everyone. It's Lisa with Ink and Inspirations, and I just wanted to share with you the uh, basis for putting one of these little cones together. A fellow demonstrator, Kimberly, shared uh, how to do this with us, and I wanted to show you uh, how to wrap this cone and get it together. You definitely need to try this. They are so cute. I can just see it hanging off the tree. Okay, so... What you're going to need is a piece of 6x6 designer series paper. Okay. Then you're going to get your paper trimmer and you're going to line each point up on that cut line, if that makes sense. I think you know what I'm talking about. Right here, the point is here on that groove and then again at the top. Okay. And then I'm just going to cut it. All right, so this is going to make two. All right, we're just going to do one right now. Now, we're, what we're going to do is we're going to put sticky strip on this, and it's going to curve like this and make the cone like that, okay? So, I'm going to put a line of sticky strip on the one side of the wrong side of the designer paper. Okay, now, you know sticky strip is sticky, so be careful, but you gotta pull this off to roll, okay? And then I'm just going to turn it and bend it over and keep rolling it until I can just press it down just like that. And take your bone folder and press down like that. Okay? Look how cute that is! It is just so cute. Okay? And then we can just get cut off this top, across the top. And you add uh, embellishments. And if you're going to add ribbon, you would put that on there before you roll it. Okay, the ribbon, like this ribbon in front, there's sticky strip along the center of the piece. Let me show you. Like right here, you put a little piece of sticky strip, and then you, attach, you stick your ribbon on there, and then you would roll it. Okay, so that it's already on there when you make your little cone. Okay, and then you can embellish as you wish. You see here I have, um, this is from the Winter Post stamp set, and I d use a decorative label punch, and I punched it twice and just layered up with the Red Riding Hood Red behind this piece, and I attached it with a trinket pin, and on the back here is a modern label punch, doubled in half with a trinket brad going through and just some baker's twine to hang it and I stuffed a little bit of tool in there. So you definitely must try that. They're fun to make. They're really pretty. You can put treats in them and have fun with it. So if you have any questions, email me at lisa at Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.